hello hello guys welcome back today we're going to be painting a couple thrift flips and a couple of these were curbside pickups so starting with these urns i'm going to paint them this color blue that i picked up at walmart a while back um, i'm mixing it with salt wash just to add some texture not really sure if this color is still available but it is um, the name is called bermuda i'm not sure if i'm saying that right but um, I'm starting off with this blue, which is way out of my comfort zone, but I decided I want to try something different. Once this dries, I'm going to start stippling on some Snow White from Waverly Chalk Paint. Here I'm just dry brushing with white just to blend in the gold a little bit. At this point I wasn't sure where I was going. I'm, I saw a picture that I was trying to recreate. Um, I was kind of tempted to just paint it all white at this point but I just kept going. Same technique here, I'm just going to go ahead and dry brush uh, some white over the blue just to bring out some of the texture.
again here just messing with color uh, my goal was to make this bucket look really old and used up I've only seen this technique done a handful of times. Um, I just dipped my brush into a cup of water and then dipped it into the paint. Um, goal is to make it look like your bucket has a bunch of paint drips. Um, I'm not sure how I feel about it, but I'll just keep going. galvanized pots i picked them up on the side of the road they look like they had been sitting outside for a good while i cleaned them up i do like the rust the patina on them so i kind of just went with it um, i'm gonna use these transfers um just to give them a little character <laughs> This little rooster I picked up at a thrift store. I'm just going to go ahead and give it some texture with some white chalk paint and some salt wash. Then here, as always, I'm going to add some antique wax over the white, and then I'm going to go ahead and dry brush it with white after.
this slip is going to be fairly easy. Um, this little carriage or wheelbarrow, I'm not sure what it is, had a box, but it was like falling apart. So I'm going to replace it with this little box. It was like a drawer to like a little old jewelry box. Um, I'm just going to simply add some moss and then the little rooster that I painted is going to sit on top. And all these items are going to go in a vignette into my booth. Here shortly you will see them all set up in my booth. If you like what you see, please subscribe and follow for more. And let me know what you think of these techniques. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.